Hey guys, in this video, I have with me Red Hawk. Let's go! First off, packaging. The Red Hulk has the same package as the Eddie Brock Venom. It is bigger than the normal uh, Marvel Legends box. So you can see the figure fills up the whole box nicely because it is a big figure. So here's the artwork at the side. And here's the back of the box. Now let's take the figure out. So here's the figure in the clamshell. You can see that there is this um, fire background in the in the uh, in the box. And this silly Hasbro, silly little note from Hasbro, which none of us have actually ever bothered to read. Yeah, so here's the figure. It comes with an extra pair of hands, the two pair of hands actually, the fist and the open two open hands. I wish that it actually comes with an alternate head. Besides this um, head that they, that they give you. Yeah. So let's get this out of the clamshell. Accessories. This figure comes with a pair of open hands and a pair of fists. Now the details on the figure is quite nice. This body has been used quite a few times uh, recently. With the green hulk and also the grey hulk. Um, it is actually has quite a, quite a lot of details. The muscles are all defined. There's veins popping out here and there. And the nails are coloured. And also that these are the torn edges, which is um looks like a separate piece which is glued on. So it's really a good a great figure. Articulation. This figure has um is able to bring up the hands like this, and the best part is it actually has a shoulder, a butterfly shoulder joint. It can be seen from the front, but you can see it clearly at the back over here there. You can see the shoulder butterfly shoulder joints. Uh, mid torso joint, waist swivel, single hinge elbow joint as usual for the big figures, the wrist, the legs can do quite a big split, calf swivel, sorry thigh swivel, there's no calf swivel unlike the Eddie Brock Venom, ankle rocker, double hinge knee joint. So this is pretty much uh, the joints for most of the big figures and I feel that it's actually quite good for for them. Yeah, it does give a wide range of articulation and especially for this one that has the butterfly shoulder joint. Now here is Spidey and 80th anniversary Captain America. You can see that the Red Hulk is a good size bigger than these other two figures. Just like how he is in the comics. So yeah. So overall, this figure is actually quite great. It's a big improvement over uh, the Target exclusive BAF Red Hulk. I think it's Target exclusive, but it's the BAF Red Hulk. Yeah, you can check out the video of that of my comparison of this Hulk with the Red Hulk um, over here. All right, stay tuned for more comparison and review videos at my channel. Hit the subscribe button and take care, everyone.